My name is David Koffer. I'm a professor of English at Carnegie Mellon. I'm one of the inventors of Classroom Salon. I've been using it for three years teaching in classrooms. Classroom Salon is designed to allow students to combine two operations at once. One, they can annotate the text before class so that they can understand what they're reading. They can also answer teacher questions before class on the document. And while they're answering those questions, lo and behold, they're also building the classroom discussion. Where were students putting their focus of attention? We can move the slider to the right, and this is a hotspot slider, so we can see, oh, I want to see where at least five students commented. Because if five students out of 17 commented, it's probably worth discussing. And so here's a passage early in the text that at least five students annotated. And it turns out that this was a very important passage because this is where the author defines what the rest of the text is going to be about. And if we click on the document, we can see the annotations of various students and what they said about it. So the students can see exactly what was to be said about this document. So what we're looking at now is the total annotations of all the students, but we also want to see um, similarities and differences in the annotation behaviors of individual students. We can do that by hiding all the annotations and simply looking at the annotations we're interested in. So we might want to see what Kristen said, okay, and we also might want to see how that may overlap with what Liz said. And if we do, we see that because of the darker color, this word began as a place that they both covered in annotations. In Salon, we can deal with the large text because I can put questions in, like what are the author's main points, beforehand, and students are making their annotations before class. So in a sense, students don't have to figure out, and I as the teacher don't have to figure out what the discussion needs to be, because the discussion in a very important sense has been pre-built. Students can ask, answer questions about what are the main points of the text. Students can also indicate if they found other students' responses helpful to their own understanding. Every student, when they respond to main points, can indicate what are the breadcrumbs. This student has a breadcrumb, and so we'll say, show your breadcrumbs. And uh, it happens to be Reem. And here, uh, we can go through the text, and Reem can indicate what are the parts of the text that allowed her to substantiate her response. Okay, All of this information used to go on in the private workspaces of students, but those private workspaces did not easily translate to classroom discussion. In Classroom Salon, we can take all that private work of students based upon reading and note-taking and aggregate it so that it actually displays in one seamless event what the class thinks about the text making the teacher's life in planning a discussion much easier.